Hey guys, Swabbleek here today and welcome back to Cities Skylines. So today we're going to be, I mean, continuing doing stuff, all the, all the, that stuff. Um, some people did point out that, uh, and I, I did notice this myself as well, <laughs> the bus stops are a, uh, a little deadly and that's because of the way I made the road. I haven't actually set up the bus stops properly in terms of in the asset editor. <laughs> Basically the buses just drive through the stop and run people over. Uh, also, oh, they're probably, they're probably going to get the other bus, aren't they? I was going to say, there's a lot of people that bus didn't pick up. Uh, but I guess that's probably going to give you some other people. Yeah, I just need to change that in the asset editor and not have the stops, like, in the pathway and all the people. Uh, yeah, i got to fix that. Still haven't fixed the, the nodes. I was trying to, I was trying to do that just before, actually, but I couldn't quite, I couldn't get it to work. So I'll have to, I think I'll have to dedicate it a day or two just to mess around with the road, see if I can get it to work. Um, anyway, moving on from that, someone else mentioned, uh, something else that I wanted to show. I think they're talking about here that they said where I upgraded the road, the four lane road to six lane road. People could, people going straight couldn't turn left at the next intersection. But I'm not really sure where you're referring to, because if you're talking about people going straight here, they can sort of change out to this line here. They keep going straight up here. The next left is up over there, which means they can change the lanes here. So they can go basically from that lane, change to this lane, change here to that lane, and then turn left. So they can. I don't know if you meant there, maybe, or otherwise people going straight this way. I mean, the next left is all the way down there, so they definitely could. I don't know where you meant, but if that's what you meant, they definitely can. Uh, it is possible for them to do it. Is this whether or not they choose to? I don't... Let's have a look. Let's see if people are doing it. Road. Uh, no one wants to go on that road anyway. So, I... Because, to be honest, I think people coming that way, they're probably going to enter back over here. Like, if we have a lot... Uh, there's just... Oh, there's someone there. Some people doing it. Although... Oh, no, that's someone leaving. I don't know. There's just not a lot of people going that way anyway. But I don't think it's because of... Let me have a look. People going straight. There's people going straight there. Most of them are just turning right or they go further up and go that way. I don't know that they want to enter left, uh, and if they do, maybe they can't. I don't know, it, it seems like they should be able to, because uh, there's no reason that they couldn't, but just to ensure that the game knows that they can, I will just manually say, hey, you're, you know, you're allowed to change lanes, you're free to be whoever you want to be, so do it. Go forth and do it. So that can also go there, and also go there. There you go. So now they definitely can there. They can change to this lane and then that lane can change there and they can definitely go left. Anyway, moving on. Uh, what else? Oh, yeah, we're going to name the road. Uh, actually, there was, there was another thing I wanted to point out. Someone someone asked, uh, it's like, why don't I ever use the priority or the, not that, the priority road thing there? We have done it multiple times, but every time we do it, it just creates traffic because it's weird. It's weird in the way that it works. Uh, like, it will cause, like, backups for ages. Like, they always stop even though if there's no cars coming. And it's really annoying, and I really disliked it, and it always caused more traffic for us than it solved. Uh, <laughs> buses on the road are so bad. Um, yeah, so we're not gonna worry about that. Right, so this, there's a few suggestions. I think I liked the one that was main pool. What was it? It was like main pool something. Oh, I've lost a comment now. I saw it before. It's, it's disappeared. Uh, da, da, da. I don't know. I've lost it. I guess, oh, main pool. It was just main pool road. Okay. Uh, because any of the ones that, like, something Avenue, Avenue didn't really make sense to me, because it's not, I don't think it's big enough to be classified as an Avenue. Although, I don't know what the definition of an Avenue is. Define Avenue, let's see. Because I always felt it was something that had, like, a median in the middle, or, like, trees or something. Here we go. A broad road in a town or city, uh, city typically having trees at regular intervals along its sides. Oh! So, along its sides, but it also defines it as a broad road. So, this road is not broad, and I would not call it an Avenue. And, uh, yeah, anyway, that's why I didn't. So, that's cool. Uh, right, that's that. I also want to... Zone here. I don't know why this isn't zoned. There's nothing on it. There's a lot of demand, though. Uh, so, low density commercial still gives us sort of slightly taller buildings. So, this is a very commercial area, actually, this whole section. So, that's actually good. Because I, I want some sort of medium-rise buildings throughout this area. So, these should uh, give us some decent ones. I guess I'll go there. Maybe that can be residential there. That's fine. And this whole area is filled out quite nicely, actually. I mean, a lot of this, I want to see if we can adjust some of this area to have a better selection of uh, little trees and all that. Not trees, what am I talking about? Well, tr yeah, sure, tree. I, you know, I don't know why I said trees. <laughs> I really don't. Just let's ignore that one. Uh, there we go. Look at that. Beautiful. Because if we do this, then it will allow us to uh, get some more houses zoned there. Where else had the issue? Oh, it's just there. But if we go like this, uh, and put it back, and then maybe here. 
I'm not sure why there's zoning tiles there. I don't know what that's come from, but they're still there too. Anyway, so that gives us a bunch of zoning there now, which is nice maybe there. Hey, we got a bit more there too now. All right, so then we just got to get a little bit out here. Like that, yeah. And then, but, but. Okay, so this should allow us to zone all of this uh, with decent sized houses, not tiny ones, which is good. Although, having said that, um, I mean, I feel like they're not going to build here for a while anyway, because we have literally no demand for residential at the moment. Hey, we're making 45,000 at the moment. I don't know how, I don't know why, but we're doing it. The other thing I wanted to do, which was actually a really good suggestion, uh, and I actually watched a video on this recently on YouTube, because I occasionally get into like binges of watching random videos, and I was watching uh, this channel called City Beautiful, where he talks about, it's like real life cities and all that, and I was talking about the, uh, like the first commuter cable car that actually exists. I mean, we're using a lot of them in our city, but this is not real, obviously, but uh, I can't remember where it was, but anyway, so people suggest that we should do a cable car, like from maybe the train station here up to the university, because I was talking about how do we get, like, a proper line going up there. We've got a buses and all that, that's cool, but... And I think that bus line will still be useful for people living down and along this road. Uh, but I think uh, the cable car would be a really good way to get some more people up that way. Uh, so if we start a line from here... Wait. End of line, there we go. Nope. End of line. There. That's where I'd want it. Unfortunately, it doesn't seem to like place being placed there. Uh, that's going to be facing the wrong way. So what we need to do is probably place it here somehow. Let me get a road up there. Let's get a road. Oh my god, look how many people are down here. This is good. This is a good little hub. Uh, so I want a road here then. Like that, okay? Now how do we get a road to join to that from essentially down here? We want it to go up. To that bit. Because I don't want them to have to walk. I mean, I guess, you know what? We don't have to have a road there. The road can join on the other side. Let me place this exactly where I want it. So this will go... Here. Let's do that. So that goes there. Obviously that... Sorry, guys. <laughs> You're going to have to move 100%. And then this road can join in here. Road guides off. Going to have to... Go oh. Going to go on this little bit. Uh, it's obviously going to intersect with that. Hang on. Go here, and then snapping off. Anarchy on. Join all these together. Hopefully this didn't create... Okay, yeah, it sort of merged all the roads together. Perfect! So then that fits in there. Then what we'll do, we'll obviously move this a little bit so that it, uh... Doesn't quite... Oh, did that actually do a tiny road there? It did. Oh, that's annoying. Oh, hang on. Move it. Back to move it. Let me delete... That section of the road, because then I'll just extend this one out. Yeah, there you go. It's better. So then that road comes around here like that. Lovely. And that can go up. And then we're going to get a pathway, obviously, that goes up there, because that's what we're going to need to get people to actually go to it. Uh, so elevated pathway from here to here. <laughs> what? Okay, no, no, no. Let me try again. Let me try again. From here. From here. Hmm. Okay, let's just uh, let's manually adjust that, I think. It's going to go here to here. Okay, looking good. Whoa, that's really smoke. Oh my god, that car. Don't park there, what are you doing? <laughs> that's probably the worst spot you could park. Where is the point for this? Oh no. I've lost it. I've lost it. It's gone. It's gone. Alright, let's just do this. Excuse me, I need I need to find the node. There it is. Uh, I would very much appreciate if no cars ever park there, but I think the only way that's going to happen is if I move all of this slightly back. Uh, which is kind of annoying. So if we move this all... Yeah, so it doesn't raise it up, because now that's still down there. It's still a little bit elevated, but it's not the worst. Okay, so then obviously this needs to move back. Oh, hang on. This needs to move back a bit, which is fine. You can do that, no problem. That building already disappeared, which is handy. Okay, so then this, I might, um, do I still want it there, or do I want to, well, that's not too bad. Well, actually, let me, uh, because I, I definitely want to put a key in here, I think, on the, on this little cliff edge. Oh, she's really big. <laughs> that's what she said. Uh, well, first of all, let's level these both to the height of that. I feel like it didn't select that one. To the height of that. 
Oh, maybe it did. Oh, okay. Anyway, that's fine. Uh, then, let's go terrain. I feel like, shouldn't this lower it down, so... Oops. No, isn't the key supposed to cover up that bit? Why is that still visible? Go away. Go. That won't go down. That's annoying. Well, maybe what I can do... Okay, okay. It's a, it's, a, it's a problem to solve. Go away, grid snapping, thank you. Go here. See, apparently the ground is there, but... Whoa. Okay, we go here. Uh, I shall use arrow keys to do... Whoa. Okay, that's... <laughs> okay, oh, too far, too far. About there. Oh, okay, so... Uh, okay, someone's just disconnecting and reconnecting to my computer. I don't know if you heard that in the recording. If you did, apologies, but that's not my fault. It's gonna go to about here. That's fine. And then from here... From here to here. Haha. -ha. That's pretty good, I think. Hopefully, it actually, you know, functions as a pathway uh, in terms of it actually connecting properly and all that. Uh, if I could select that point, that'd be great. I reckon that's probably connecting. Do you reckon it's connecting? Answer now with these options on screen. If I was really smart, wait, where are we into the video now? 11 minutes. If I was really smart, hopefully I added like a little... <laughs> a card-based poll. How good would that be? If I did, please vote on it. Uh, there we go. This along. Oh, I'm still selecting that one up there. Hang on. Just these two. Because I just want that... I don't want that hill to be too steep. So I'll bring that back in there so it joins there. So that should be joined like that. Unfortunately, it likes to do a bit of concrete there, which is kind of annoying. Uh, so we're going to put some... Let's get some foliage in the way. Maybe some of these guys. Oh, I don't know. Brush eyes. Go down to single. Thank you. Oh, that's actually not too bad. Uh, that's a little bit bigger than I thought it was. Regular bush. What? How's this still one there? I need to turn down the strength because it's placing too many of them. Uh, about there. Just want to cover that up a little bit. Just so it doesn't look like there's a big bit of concrete leading up to it. Oh, there you go. I mean, it looks a bit steep. I mean, it looks a lot steep, but let's just pretend it's stairs. Uh, and then it's fine. Oh, look, it's stairs. That's fine. Cool. Uh, so then this is going to go here. So it turns snapping back on for me. Uh, yeah, really wish that bridge extended to that point instead of having all these annoying little sections here. Let me do this, and we're going to get elevated all the way along to there. Just so it saves us a little bit of weird bridgery there. And then let's get out... Uh, Actually, no, we're not going to have any zone in there because it's going to be a cable car right there. Okay, so we finally got the station in. We're going to be interested to see if people walk up this way because... Oh, there's people walking down this way. Great, that means that's working. That's fantastic. Uh, so now we're going to want to take the cable car probably... I'm not going to go directly through this stuff. I think we'll go like around and then up because just so we don't destroy a lot of stuff along the way. Now, that's going to come up pretty much... I mean, right to here, really, in the middle of this, this area. I think it would be a good idea. Maybe not directly in the middle of it, but... It should be around this sort of central hub. Maybe... I mean, it really should be... Can I not... Why can I not go on that road at all? Is, oh, is it because there's a pathway there? Let me remove those pathways. Because I kind of want it on that road there. Maybe I, I do want it in the middle? Do I want it in the middle? Let's see. Actually, you know what? That's not so bad. It kind of... Especially because it's got that sort of park sort of front to it. It almost does look like it sort of belongs there. I don't think that's too bad. So, if we go from here... Oh, cool. Look, Anarchy without... Oh, you know what? It is probably actually too low. For, yeah, that's probably going to be way too low to go over that road. Um, you know what? Maybe not. Look, let's build it like this. If it's too low, we can maybe raise it up a little bit. We'll see how we go. Alright, so then, let me build from this side. So, I'm going to go from here... Um, I really, I don't, really don't want to have to like fang out. If I just destroy a little bit of those buildings, it's not too bad, is it? There's still a bunch of, oh, there's so much empty space there now though. You know? You know what I mean? Do you know, do you know, or do you not know what I mean? If we just move it this way a little bit more. Oh! Too far. There. 
I think if we put it there, so it's a little further along, then hopefully if we just readjust that, then we get a little bit more zoning there. Can we get any here? No. If we put a road here, though, we definitely could. Let me get one of these. We got one tile of zoning. That's all you can get from that? I feel like we can get more out of that, and I feel like if I just play something there myself, it'll be better. Uh, most of it is going to be way too big. I need to get, like, some small st <laughs> Pull out that. I need to get some, like, small, like, nice little stores, I think, because... Like, these are all clearly stores that sort of join into a center of some sort. Is there, like, a small office or something? Is there actually houses? I could place a house, probably. Uh, it's too... yeah, something... Sm oh, here we go, like this. Yeah, these would be good. Oh, hang on, I rotated the wrong way. I do like these. What is the difference between these? Did I, did I or did I not select two different ones? Row A, B. Oh, no, I don't think... Oh, there we go. Yeah, I feel like even though it was selected, it wasn't. Go away. There we go. Um, let me get these over here as well. Coming through. Okay, I guess that's it. Does that look weird? I mean, it definitely does look weird, doesn't it? Maybe get rid of those ones. And then maybe just move these together a little bit or something. Make it sort of look like one kind of complex and then we can get something else at the end. I just get like four like that and then something else. Because I, I think, unless we specifically design an area that makes sense with these buildings having them all, like a load of them like that looks a bit weird. Uh, maybe... No, that's way too big. See, I don't want those because they all look way too like sort of modern. No, apartment blocks. We can get a small apartment block or something through here. Make sure I'm clicking these properly. Do this one here. Maybe, I mean, maybe. I kind of like the idea of it. I, I don't know why I put it there. You know what? I don't know why I put it there. And the... Get, there we go. The reason I don't know why I put it there is because it I just decided to leave one gap of zoning, which is annoying. So I put it there. And then maybe we can get, like... What's this one? What's this one? Is there, like, another one we could do here? How are these all the same? These are not all the same, surely. Two... And... What's this one? Three. Okay, they're all like slight variations. So I don't want to do the same one. Is there like a... This could fit there. The townhouse. It's a little strange because uh, there's no windows on that. So, like it doesn't seem like it fits, really. Oh my god, why is it so hard to select stuff in this game? Like I swear, like I, I know I complain about this all the time, but like... How many times do I have to click something? I'm just going to put that house there. Why not? And then, let me just click it a few times, there we go, to make sure I actually got it. Put that there. There you go, there's a few things around there now. I think it needs a few trees in the middle too, just to make it look a little bit nicer. Right, so there's definitely people walking up that way, so it's definitely working. This bus stop is certainly fairly popular. So, let's go over here now. So this uh, cable car, now we can finally build it, can go up this way. Almost directly connect to that. Uh, this is... Appearing to try to go through the land for some reason. So let me turn off anarchy. Let me turn off anarchy and just do it again because I think that is uh Oh no, it still did it even without anarchy. Really? Really? You built it like that. How is that a good idea? Idiot. <laughs> okay, I go straight there first, and then we'll go from here and down. Like this. How's that? That's better. Wait. It's still uh I guess. Oh. Okay, well, prop anarchy. That's a, that's a classic one. <laughs> Whoops. Uh, but still, I, I mean, even with prop anarchy, it, why is it... Okay, at least it cleans out the trees now. But... Oh, that's better. Yeah, it's much better. Okay. So this should be operating now. In theory. Oh, it just had a vehicle spawn, whether it was here or the... I like how it's, that cable is so so droopy. Oh, that's plenty of room. You don't need an. Oh wow, do you see that? Yeah, that cable. They really should tighten that cable up there. That's a very. <laughs> it's a little. It's a little loose. Maybe we can do this run here in one section. That might be a little bit better. I'll see anarchy on it. It should be fine. Let's have a look. Oh yeah, that's better. Yeah. yeah, yeah. It doesn't need to do that a little bit. And then it goes down. And provides a really direct connection to the university up that way. Which is cool. Uh, so, let's have a look. Do you reckon people are using this? 
Currently no one, but there might be some people going there now. Now that it has a you, oh, there's a cyclist. Oh, he's going in. Hooray! Our infrastructure makes sense in some way. So we're good. Ah, that's good stuff. <laughs> All right, so let's go uh, again. I just want to kind of expand this area. I actually, you know what? Let's have a look. Uh, so traffic-wise. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. This is busy through here. I mean, I'm not surprised because there's a lot of people coming that way to get to the university. That's fine. That's the industrial area. And then that is sort of also industrial area. So that makes sense. That's good. Now, I would love to... Well, let's have a look. So we've got a cable car there. I wonder if we can get one. I do like the ideas of cable cars. I'm getting, I'm getting into them now. This is surprisingly more busy than I ever intended this road to be. Like the road is really busy. Is this- oh, is this just a giveaway? Is that what's happening up here? Uh, 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 yeah, it is. So that's why it's taking so long. Um, I mean, this really should just be turned into a one-way rather than two-way. So let me have a look real quick. Yeah, let me move. So this is one bus line that stops here twice. Well, if we do a left-hand loop, that bus stop's already fine. That one would just need to change to the other side, which is no problem. This one, a little more complicated in terms of it has to sort of loop a couple of times a little strange. It works though, it's fine. Instead of just going down there, it sort of just goes the other way. Alright, I just wanted to change that first before we turn this into a one way. Because it's just going to get a little bit messy otherwise. There you go, so now it's one way around there. So that means there's a couple more lanes to sort of determine where you go instead. Now this hasn't messed up the bus lines in terms of how they turn, has it? No, that's fine. I think they're fine. Hold on. Actually, apparently... No, there we go. I was gonna say, wait, what? Oh, that's just changing lines. Okay, yep, good. No worries. All right, that, that works fine. I think that's just going to help us out a little bit. Uh, gives us a few more options here. I might even... You know what? I might do traffic lights here because... Why not? I think it gives us a little bit more freedom. And I kind of want to... No, that thing... I think that one needs to turn both. I was going to say, I want to turn that into... Uh, only right, but I think that would mess up the buses if that was the case. Although, I just want to see real quick. That bus goes there. Oof, that was a tight turn. There's no, yeah, there's no merge point there. Okay, yeah, so you have to decide your lane back here. That's actually quite good. Okay, I'm quite happy with that. Right, I did like nothing there, but I'm happy with it. <laughs> I'm happy with it. Good job, me. I think there was a suggestion to add another train station somewhere as well. I think, hang on, let me train. Uh, you should, no, that's, uh, wait, you should stop that bus line at the train station, we'll make it, uh, there's another one, actually. Uh, I feel like there's some other... I've got a cable car from the train station, yeah, that was a good one, I like that. Yeah, there's a few comments about that. Are you gonna put a train station in the new area, like, through here? No, because this is, this line here is a cargo line. And this one is a passenger line, but there's not really anywhere to stop, and besides we have a stop just here. So, I don't really need it. It's not really an easy way to do one either. I swear there's another comment about... Uh, doo -doo -doo. Let's see... Could you... Mm, I don't know. Oh, uh, there, there's this comment though, it's quite funny. Do, uh, do Vegas, that design was looking good. Need something other than roads or trains. I mean, you do realize the, the Vegas thing that we were doing was roads and trains. And that's what this game is, is building roads. And also trains occasionally, and other forms of public transport. Um, that like that's literally what this is. I think I want to. I would love to have like some roads extending up this hill, like getting close to joining up, but you know, like not actually. I think it would look really, really cool to have like a road here. So if we go like this, like sort of as far as we can realistically get, like that gets pretty steep there, and then have like roads. Like through this area, and I think it would be cool, and I, I wish we could get like another... I mean, you know what, we might be, I was gonna say, we might be able to get another stop on the cable car, maybe here. So have a stop along the way, like there, there, and then up the top. Though I don't know if it's really long enough to warrant one, but... It'd be cool. This is gonna go here. Go up. No zoning on that side, which is kind of annoying. I mean, I guess we could build here. Actually, we could even bridge across if we wanted. Do we want to bridge across again? I mean, we've got so many bridges along here. I don't know that we need another one. We could actually, we can even take this road over here and go around. Hmm. That'd be interesting. So this could actually be like an alternate route almost for some of the area. So this could join right there. 
Yeah, that's actually not a bad idea. Go here. Uh, about there should allow us to curve it a little bit better. Uh, road, where is... Oh, pfft. How is that <laughs> lining up with that road? Oh, these actually don't line up too well. If we go here, though, we should be able to get it. Whoop. So there. And then there. That's good. Alright, so that joins around that way. That's actually not bad. I like it. Then we can sort of get this area through here as well. Like, I don't want this to be a dead straight grid or anything. Um, I think... If, I don't know why it's... What is it snapping to? It's like doing really weird snapping. Stop it. Just... <laughs> stupid thing. That's better. It kept doing like weird force. It's like forcing me to do curves. I'm like, what are you? What are you doing? No, I don't want to do that. Let's just join here. Okay, so then that goes through that way. I think that was pretty good. Uh, put, there should definitely be something here because I feel like th definitely be zoning right there. Yeah, nice. Uh, cable car. That's there. That's too steep. So maybe go a little bit lower on this this side here. I think I'm gonna go here. Sorry, get the house out of the way. Thanks, buddy. So we can get some zoning to there. Maybe this one can come through here somewhere. And this can come up this way. It's really just... Look at this. Roads. And next, if we do trains, that person will be super happy. Because it's just roads and trains. I think that's what, that, that's what they asked for, isn't it? Just roads and trains? They're like, your series doesn't have enough roads or trains. And I'm like, you know what? You're not... You're not wrong. We need more roads and trains. I really want that road to go there. It's just not going to happen. <laughs> this is not going to work. So that's going to be there. Okay. And this one can come up this way. And then we can get one probably here somewhere. That's about it. <laughs> uh, oh. We can get some through like the sort of more hilly area, but not far. So get like there. Maybe this can come up. No, that's way too steep in that point. But I think that gives us a good like little area to sort of expand into a little bit. It's like they've, they've tried to get more land, but it's like, no, that's it. That's all we can get. <laughs> like, that's all we that's all we can get. We're, we're really trying, guys. It's just not working. Uh, oh, there we go. Through here. Now, I think what we should do... I mean, we're nearly... I think we're nearly done, sort of... Like, we've been spending a few episodes on this area, and I think we're, we're doing pretty well. I think it's really come along in terms of the whole space. Uh, I Like I said, I do want to extend down this way and sort of join the, the two up, and probably more... Like, re I just really want to develop this whole sort of corner of the, like, the map. I guess sort of pretty much everything bordered by that train line. I want that to all pretty much be filled in as a uh, sort of expanse from the, the downtown. Like, so just a little bit of sprawl. And then realistically, realistically, probably a lot of that too. But I don't know how long this will go for, because I'm planning on doing, like, we'll, I think we'll start an entirely new series for uh, the Park Life DLC when that comes out. But that doesn't mean we're going to be stopping this. I think we'll probably have, we'll probably have a couple series running at a time then, because I, I'm not quite ready to just, you know, throw in the towel on this series. Like, it's just, it's not done yet, you know, and it's not broken. It's not, it's not, there's nothing wrong with it. Uh, like a series, the, the, the city's not broken or anything. It still works. Although having said that, actually, when when the update comes out, it probably will break. Like in terms of we'll have to wait for all the mods to update. So we could start the new series then, but then also, you know, continue this one at the same time. I think that's what I want to do. And then eventually that Park Life series will probably become the new main series after we sort of wrap this one up. I don't, but it will probably, I think what we'll do, we'll probably go like Park Life series, um... And we'll probably do quite a lot of episodes on that in a short period of time because this city won't work with the mods. They, they won't be updated. So we'll probably focus on that. But then when the mods are working again, we'll focus on sort of this city again until we're done. But, you know, doing both at the same time. If that makes sense. I think that's how I want to do it. So let me know in the comments down below your thoughts on my plan. Because I think that's probably I think that's probably the way to do it. Because I don't think we can fully experience... Uh, the park life DLC in this city. Like, I mean, we can definitely build some parks. Like, we should, we'll be able to use that DLC to do, like, maybe a proper national park that we can have ticketed. And we could do uh, a little theme park as well with it. But I think the best way to use that DLC would be to start a new city sort of designed around having proper parks and all that. Um, and I think that will be a cool way to do it. Now, I would like to remove 
some of these uh, buildings here. And I think what we're going to do, we're going to put in a factory here. Not a factory, like a warehouse here. Like, I want it to still be industrial, but I don't want it to be like dirty smokestack industrial. You know what I mean? So I want to replace it with like some of the... Again, why do I have to click it so many times that it's too big? Is there a small? Is there a smaller one that fits in this area? Oh, this does. This would also fit here. It's very tall. In this area, like it's very, very elevated. It also fit one more there, and then maybe just on this end part we can do just a little bit of office space. Because I didn't want to completely redevelop with offices. Wow, that's really tall. But I mean, that's fine. There could, there could be like a kitty there or something. Anyway, I just wanted to get rid of like the 100% dirty industrial. Including this little bit here. I don't... Oh, actually, we might be able to get that smaller little one in here. Can I go the other way? Oh yeah, here we go. If I put it on this road, put it there, move it. Just so it's actually in the corner a little bit better. Move it to there. Hopefully those buildings should just automatically disappear by themselves. So then it's still like, oh yeah, this area is industrial. It hasn't been completely like redeveloped, but it's also still not completely 100% dirty and polluting. That's kind of the idea. And then I think from here, I want to just go office space along this side section here. Should be good. Then maybe, maybe even high density commercial. There's some pretty, pretty intense commercial building there. Uh, not one that's obviously going to be, let's go housing there. That's not going to be super tall, like it shouldn't be, because I think, I'm pretty sure we have high-rise band on here. But even still, most of this is low density, so. It's really coming along though, I think this is a good area. This edge of the cliff looks terrible though, <laughs> I think. I think that needs to be smoothed out a lot. Maybe we can, uh, can I do something about that real quick? Because that's not good. The problem with the, the default tools is like, if you try to smooth it, it doesn't, like it doesn't recognize that it needs to be moved back a little bit further. Like I need a level this further back into the mountain a bit and then if we smooth that bit that's further back it'll be much better it just looks so dumb otherwise so bring it further back yeah good and then it's like smooth with like a rough brush or something it might look better like that we could even even do elevate but make the brush strength like really low because then this will just give us a little bit of texture to the hill. And push some bits back a little bit. There you go. It'll, it'll, it'll get there. And then it'll just look so, it'll just look so much better than um, what we had. So bring this a little bit up because it's a little bit far back there. There you go. I think we need to... Can I get more on this? I just need to... I think some of these little areas in here, they're a little too flat, I think. Brush size, make it a little bit bigger. But the strength should still be really low, yeah. Oh, border save. Well, I mean, I think that already looks miles better than before. So, that's alright. I think it, I th it looks a little strange having these tall buildings right next to nothing. <laughs> like, I don't know. But anyway, I think the, at least that edge looks better. I mean, this is still a little bit, uh, little bit dodge, but that's okay. Uh, so this area is, it's all zoned, but they're not really moving into it at the moment. We just don't have that sort of residential demand. I am actually interested to see how this is going. This got some good use. 256 people actually use it, so, and also, oh, look at all this, look at all these people coming up here. I wonder if these are, these like, I mean, they're all wearing hats. They're going to Biodome, apparently, in the university, so that's kind of cool. So they go here, they cross, they get in the cable car, they go up. And then I assume they're transferring to a bus over this way somewhere. So they'll come out and they'll go like, blip. Actually, I don't know if they can walk through this anymore. What side of the road was this placed on? I don't know that they can. I might see if I can just connect that through there. So even though it sort of goes through a hedge. Actually, if I do this as well, it sort of should be technically joined here in a way. So those guys can walk through there. Instead of doing like the weird sort of angled ones, I'm just going to do straight past because I think it looks better that way. Uh, so that should be like that. Are these people just walking to the biodome or are they walking somewhere else? Because the biodomes are down there. But there's a lot of people going to them. I mean, get the bus. I have buses for a reason. Oh my god. It's fine though. It seems to be working. Nice. Okay, that's cool. Uh, see, I want to see if people use that. Oh, they totally do now. Oh, that's good. They can now walk through the park instead of having to like leave this. Because, I mean, that makes sense. It's definitely is like 
quite clearly joined there, so. Cool. How are all these buildings going? I think they're all good, like... This area is nice, this bus stop is busy. Let's have a look at this bus line, actually. 75, 43, 36, 36, 73, 66, 84, and 20. That's pretty good, that's pretty good usage of that bus line that we built. Uh, what about the other one, actually? Where is that? It's here. I wonder how this one goes. 48 people on that one, but... Uh, oh, wow, it's pretty busy. 23, 69, <laughs> 20, 20, 14, 90, 2 on that one. I mean, there's a lot of buses, so 10, 6, 79. There might be a few too, bus few too many buses in the middle. Wait, why are they all, like, there's, like, a million buses here, and then these are, like, miles apart. How strange. And it is, I mean, it is a pretty damn long bus line, actually. It's not, it's probably, it's probably a little too long for a bus line. I think we should probably... I don't know. It's a good bus line, but I think it's it should be have another... It should have another form of transport on it, probably. I don't know. Anyway, I'm doing this part here. We didn't do a whole lot, but I think we... I think I laid down some groundwork for some good future ideas. So let me know what you think about doing this sort of park life series at the same time. Uh, and then also... There's that. And I think maybe next time we'll just do a time lapse of building in this area. Because, I mean, I think we've done enough through here. It's going to be more of the same. More of the same with this kind of stuff. I think I'll just fill in this, fill in that. And then we're pretty much done with that, then we can move on to something else. But anyways guys, thanks for watching, I will see you next time, and have an awesome day.